If the plans by the Lagos State Government is implemented, residents in Lagos will begin paying their house rent monthly. This comes on the heels of the second Lagos Real Estate Marketplace Conference held in Lagos. TVC News correspondent Theophilus Ilama has more on the story. 17 million. That's the figure attributed to the housing deficit in Lagos State. And that is according to a figure released by BizWatch Africa. That figure is the highest in Africa with an urbanization rate of 4.78%. With that troubling figure, the Lagos State Government says it is now ready to ensure affordable housing in the state. In the last about 10 years, Lagos has encouraged the monthly tenancy through the rent to own. So what we do is we get the 5% deposit, we do a pre-qualification process and make sure that you are what you are and who you are when it comes to your income. Once the pre-qualification takes place, we go ahead and we let you pay on a monthly um, basis for the next 10 years and then you become that homeowner. But we're also toying with another idea outside of what government builds. Um, the rent to earn is specifically for government projects, but we also want to do a rental scheme right now, which is a monthly rental scheme, whereby um, the landlords are unaffected. We're going to pull, pull a consortium of funds and a consortium of um, um, low interest funds where we can bring it to the aid of the people. As part of our Lagos resilience policy, we want to make Lagos a more resilient state whereby people can have choices, uh, especially in their living standard. We did a rental experience survey and we found out that 88% of Lagosians would rather pay their rent monthly. So that became an important piece of policy for the government to pursue. Now the government believes that its housing schemes across the state will be affordable for many. Every year, January, everybody is uptight about rents and school fees. So this is one great policy that Mr. Governor is looking at that um, we're all looking forward to. Monthly tenancy is here in Lagos and it will stay in Lagos. The deficit is so high and it's a work in progress. We can't, you know, capture everyone, but we're doing everything we can. Yesterday, the governor reeled out what he's going to do in the next couple of days or weeks. Uh, we're going to probably commission the Shongeta Do scheme, which has 744 units. And we're even looking into Odono and which has 660 units. They're all coming on the rent-to-own scheme. And government is just doing so well to make sure that this housing deficit is breached. So far, the Lagos State Governor Babajide Somolu has promised to make available to developers 50 hectares of land for the construction of housing units as part of efforts to reduce the housing deficit in the state. Theophilus Ilama, TVC News, Lagos.